What's up, YouTube? Uh, it's your boy, Tone. And I'm going to do a, a video about black hair. Now, if any of you watch my, uh, my YouTube channel, uh, check it out. You'll see that I've had, you know, I've had the locks. I've had the bald head, you know, I've had the, you know, the afro-ish, you know, like that type of deal. And, uh, you know, so I have many transitions of black hair. But, you know, I don't notice, I don't notice a lot of, like, dudes have videos of their, like, hair. Like, I know it's a girl thing for hair, but it actually, it, it's a guy thing, too, because, you know, we like to shape up some, you know, if we got a fro, we like to keep our fro, you know, like moist, you know what I'm saying? So you can get yourself to spray and be like. You know the deal. Uh, so anyway, so here is my black hair. Well, another one of my black hair videos. And I just want to, uh, I want to point out some things. Okay. So. Of course, you know, back in the day, back in the day when, you know, you used to have, the, you know, Afro Sheen to keep it clean and all that other good stuff. For all of you youngins, we used Afro Sheen back in the day. And I had a real bouffant back then. It wasn't, wasn't, wasn't very attractive, but nonetheless, I, I had it. Okay. And I'm going to just go ahead and into that. But anyways, so nonetheless you know so what has taken a place of afro sheen well there's still afro sheen and people still use it but you know they also use the blue magic joint you know what i'm saying uh i tried to use this a little bit but uh the petroleum in it just doesn't really you know sit well with me anymore you know there's all kind of chemicals and you can read the back of it which i'm not going to do because i was born and if you do it you'll find there's a lot of mysterious stuff and you know in some of these products okay so yeah so but basically my hair was like i noticed that it was flaking under uh, you know uh, that my scalp was flaking so you know as my hair was growing i noticed that i had a lot of dandruff so i tried to you know hey you go ahead and use to sell some blue joint i'm not sure if that worked or not so i was like all right i gotta do something so I went to some sisters and you know, natural natural hair sisters, nothing against those of you who rock your hair however you want to. But I went to some sisters who had locks, you know. So don't, don't start spamming me about, you know, hair weave and all that. You do what you got to, keep it neat, keep it tight, I'm with you. Uh, nonetheless, uh, I went to some sisters with some locks and I was like, yo, what are you, what are you putting in your hair? And they was like, you know, oil, like olive oil. So I went, you know, to Kroger, Kroger's, and uh, bought me some olive oil. Start, you know, putting this in my hair. And it did its thing, you know, it was it was working, but I still noticed that my hair was flaking a lot and I started getting like scabs on my head because I was always like, you know, what in the world? Because I think it was just, it was, I don't think my hair was ready. I don't think my scalp was ready for my hair. Uh, like I said, I'm no hair therapist. I don't know. I'm just a dude out here trying to, you know, keep it tight. So uh, after I bought that, I put that on, you know, and uh, basically it's a scalp treatment, added sheen, heat protection, bath body, and nail, so on and so forth. So I was like, all right. And uh, got a lot of sisters for, you know, know what they're talking about. So after that, I was like, okay, well, I'm gonna try a different product. So I tried uh, olive oil again, but this one is made by uh, Honeywood Youth. This one is made by Palmer's. I know uh, you ladies are very familiar with both of these products. So I started spraying this in my hair, but it didn't seem like it was, it didn't seem like it was thick enough. You know what I'm saying? Like at that time I had some hair, like I just cut my hair today. So if you look at my video from like three weeks ago, my hair was a little long, you know, it was out. And basically, uh, I started spraying this on, but it was good for like the top, but it wasn't really getting into my scalp unless I stayed there for a long time going. Shh, 
no. Okay, I wasn't. I wasn't going. You know. Okay. So 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 yeah. I also tried um, olive oil, and this is by uh, Organic Root Stimulator. Uh, yeah. Now this is extra rich for dry, thirsty hair. My hair wasn't exactly dry and thirsty, but my scalp was definitely dry and thirsty. So I did go ahead and try this. All right. It did its thing. My hair was no longer dry and thirsty. And then I finally settled on uh, do grow. Now this right here went straight to the problem. It, it just, I mean, it went straight, boom, right in, and it was on and popping from right there. And, I, you know, it's a stimulant growth growthing oil is that how they say it uh, stimulated growth oil and this stuff works you know what I'm saying so not to say that the other stuff didn't work but uh, this right here really got to uh, the root of the problem no pun intended and uh, basically my scalp wasn't as dry but it was you know it was still a little dry so uh, I'm saying this to say I think you gotta before before you grow a you know an afro or whatever, you gotta treat your scalp. You gotta constantly treat your scalp. So when your hair does grow in, your scalp isn't suffering. And uh, that's what happened to me. And that was that was kind of new to me because you know I've, I've had hair before. I've never had nothing like that happen. So you know it was, uh, it was like I said it was new. And although I was like busting out with the head and shoulders and trying to you know get rid of the flake, it wasn't helping because my head my washing my hair like once a week and of course that was taking the oil out so I stopped washing my stopped washing my hair as much and uh, things just started to kick back into shape so uh, ladies fellas y'all out there who's got some advice on hair put them up you know don't think that it's like a girl thing oh you know only just it's everybody's thing because we all need advice Skincare, hair care. I watch your videos and I'm 100% straight. You know, I watch because I'm gonna learn something. I don't look, I don't even care if you're a white dude. If you're a white dude, you got some, I watch it because I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going to use any of that information, but I'll look at it for a minute and be like, okay, that's something that I now know. I'm not gonna study it, but I will observe it. You know what I'm saying? So, people out there who's doing stuff with you, you know. There's people like me who is always looking for information, and that's what YouTube is for. It's your boy, Tony202. Peace and love. All that good stuff. <laughs> Peace, love, and happiness. <laughs> All right.